Glow Beauties, I got me my first ever product empties video. And I decided, I'm gonna put this down because it's kind of heavy. And I decided I'm gonna call it Trash It or Cash It because I kind of wanted to put a little spin on it. It's not much of a spin, it's whether I'm just gonna buy it again, cash it, or whether I'm gonna never see the daylights out of it again and trash it. And then there is the cash it on repeat, whether it's something that I really love so much it pretty much becomes a holy grail, so I keep on cashing it, buying it and repeat, or whether it's something that, you know, I would cash it again, but I might put it on the side because I want to try something else, but I would buy it again. So it's going to be called Trash It or Cash It. So first up is my Andalou Naturals Clementine C Illuminating Toner. Now, for me, the one thing I love, okay, first of all, we're gonna know this. This is a cash it. Definitely, I would buy this again. The reason why is, for me, when I'm looking for skincare, I tend to look for um, the different uses of it. Of course, I need a toner, but I'm also looking for the ingredient profile. I'm looking for specific ingredients to fit the bill of what I want to do with my skin. This fit the bill because I was looking for a toner that didn't have alcohol in it. Also, I didn't want witch hazel because witch hazel, when they use generally use witch hazel, it's bound with alcohol. So I don't want witch hazel and I wanted something that had vitamin C in it and also had glycolic acid and this fit the bill. And it had extras. The first ingredient on here is aloe vera juice. Um, it has lovely antioxidants. It has the vitamin C and magnesium ascorbyl phosphate. It has sodium PCA which is a beautiful humectant. It has fruit stem cells. Apparently that's supposed to be good. Uh, eight berry complex. So I'm loving this because it's got a lot of those antioxidants in there. And so it was a great way to start putting back the moisture into my skin before I moved on to my essence. So I really enjoyed this. Lasts a long time. You get six ounces in here. It's a great price at Healthy Planet for only $12.99. So I'm very happy with this. This is cash it on repeat now this is a japanese skincare this is my holy grail this is called hada labo roto okay it's a long name gochu i'm gonna kill the pronunciation gokuchin hyaluronic lotion moist this is my hyaluronic acid treatment, okay? This is what I use morning and night as my hyaluronic acid. It's kind of like an essence, but the um, texture and viscosity is, it has a little bit more body than an essence, but not as much body as a serum. And so I use it in between those two as part of my layering of humectants into my skin. I will not leave home without this. This is an amazingly elegant product. You don't need a lot of it. It absorbs deeply into your skin layers because it has three different types of hyaluronic acid derivatives of sodium hyaluronate. They're both all low molecular weight hyaluronic acid. So the molecules are small and they go deeper into your skin cells. They, and they stay there and they, they give you all that, you know, moisture into your skin. However, with low molecular weight hyaluronic acid I know I'm giving a lot of details um, they don't always they will absorb deep but they won't always stay long in your skin so it kind of loses its effectiveness over time quickly but there is one so um, hyaluronic acid here called sodium ac acetylated a sodium acetylated yes hyaluronate this version is made by patented by Shiseido and it is hydrophilic and hydrophobic and so it when it absorbs into your skin it stays there it lasts a long time and then you've got the sodium hyaluronate and then you also have hydrolyzed hyaluronic acid which is one of the more common ones that um, will absorb in but don't stay as long but the sodium acetylated hyaluronic acid stays put in your skin. First one I uh, was introduced to 
hyaluronic acid serums was a number of years ago Celex C and um, SkinCeuticals made a version uh, called Hydra B5. Back then it wasn't as elegant and it wouldn't absorb into my skin so I would have this kind of weird jelly-like film on my skin that would peel. I hated it. I didn't understand what it was doing for my skin. It wasn't absorbing. I didn't feel the benefits of it and so I decided I'm not even going to bother with that nonsense. It's just a bunch of snake oil. And then this came along when they started to do a better formulations. The Japanese and the Asians really know how to do that kind of stuff. Once I got this into my hands, it was a done deal. It's not snake oil. This hydrates your skin like you wouldn't believe and the funny thing is a friend of mine I know I'm going on as in because this is so important a friend of mine told me because it's not just vitamin C and the A B A A's and the C's and the niacinamide and the exfoliation you need the hydration it is so important or your skin will age without hydration it will age those cells will age and the thing is with this is that it hydrates your skin and a friend of mine who loves to do mountain climbing he's gone into all these places I think he's even climbed Mount Everest he said that the people that live on the mountains there's a certain area where it goes a lot to where the people live on the mountains and they will be your guides and everything their skin ages so fast because of course they're in high altitudes they're exposed to sun more they don't use moisturizer on their skin or sunblock and their skin ages like a mofo and he said even the teenagers look like they have aged skin of a 50 year old or 60 year old or 70 year old because they've never been um, replenishing their skin with moisture and their uh, their skin is um, so exposed to the elements and the sun and the low oxygenation and higher altitudes so their skin ages really fast so one of the things he says because they don't moisturize their skin and of course they don't wear sunblock so this is important and I feel this has made a humongous difference in my skin health and in my skin's youth so I will not stop buying this I have a backup and I will back keep on backing it up it this used to be just like $13 or $15 but over time it's gotten more expensive so it's about $21 but still very affordable lasts a long time for my smaller face I only need three drops if I'm doing my next I only need four five drops you don't need a lot and it you can control the drops it's amazing amazing this is another empty this is a cash it on repeat I will buy this forever if I have to this is the loyal professional technique art fixed design spray this is a hairspray okay sorry directional fixing spray fix five or force five I love this because my hair is super super fine I can fake the funk by putting in a lot of hairspray putting my head upside down and picking it out before I hairspray but my hair is very thin and it's very 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 sensitive hair so I can't be using any of like the normal hairsprays or hairsprays from I cannot buy hairspray from the drugstore and use that in my hair my hair will die in two weeks this stuff I can wear on my hair it doesn't damage my hair it gives me body and also it gives me movement so when the wind blows my hair will still move around and look a little bit natural but it stays put so if I didn't have this hairspray my hair would flop within five minutes and I wouldn't look so nice so <laughs> this has been so amazing for my hair I will not leave home without it literally this is still as aqua glow serum foundation my cousin gave this to me a year ago as a Christmas present and I have never stopped using it or buying it. They got great colors for me for the winter. They got great colors for me for the summer. If I use it in the summer, I may mix it with something else to deepen it up, but this is beautiful. They have great colors for, well, anyway, my range for my skin tone. Also, I just love uh, the coverage. It's medium coverage and it's just lovely on my skin and it goes with my skin tone. They got the right under colors. They got everything. It gives you a slight glow. It's beautiful and 
I won't leave home without this one either. So it's a cash okay. it. So now we're on to face cleansers. This is the Tatcha Pure One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. You know what I'm gonna say. It's a cash it on repeat. Love this stuff, though it is kind of expensive. I think it's Canadian $58. I'm still trying to find a dupe for this because it's a whopper of money. And the way I try to save my money in using this is I use one uh, pump for my eyes. This is wonderful because I have super duper sensitive eyes, even though it has, and it's made from green tea oil. And even though it has some fragrance in it but you don't you don't smell it and so and my eyes aren't bothered by it it gets off my makeup quickly however I have to say one caveat with this I've been buying it for a while and the last couple of times I bought it the viscosity of it is a bit thinner with that it takes longer for me to get my mascara off my eyes and so I'm a little bit disappointed that they've made this product thinner. I'm going to be calling Katasha up eventually to ask them why they did that because when I initially used this it used to be much easier to get my mascara off and I used the exact same still a huge last extreme mascara so nothing's changed so this is still works it's beautiful, it's a lovely, elegant product, feeds your skin, wonderful to massage in your skin if you take your makeup off first with say a microfiber wipe and then go in with this, it's wonderful to use to massage into your skin. Very amazing oil, love it. This is my Elizabeth Grant Vi Green Power C Vitamin C High Potency Night Serum. You get two ounces in this. I love this. Again, this is a serum. It has vitamin C in it, ascorbyl glucoside. So it is not going to fit the bill of what I need in vitamin C, but it's nice to have a little bit of it in a, a vitamin C derivative. It's a lovely product. I know it's not on support. For, uh, got it on the shopping channel the Canadian version of the other one I forgot a couple of years ago still loving this I believe you can get it on Elizabeth Grant's um, website now because it's not on the shopping channel anymore but I will still keep this I love this and the reason why is again because of the ingredient line in here I was specifically on a was originally looking for a serum I wanted a serum that had a bit of vitamin C at the time I was a too allergic to vitamin C to have L ascorbic acid on my skin so I needed a derivative this fit the bill also I wanted two other ingredients and that is red clover extract and um, wild yam root it had both of them in here and I was a happy camper and the reason why is that these two are plant estrogens don't use this if you have any history of breast cancer or breast cancer in your family if you don't feel free to use this but check with your dog I really wanted those ingredients because I want it to absorb into my skin These are plant phytoestrogens and I wanted to use it topically on my skin because I heard that doing it topically also benefits the skin and helps the skin to act younger replenish its cells more like you're in your 20s like in, when you're young and not going through menopause this is a wonderful product for that and so that is the reason why I got it and it's got the extras it's got aloe vera juice in here I mean, sodium hyaluronate green tea extract spirulina extract broccoli seed oil cucumber extract glycerin so it's got all the good ingredients that I want to see in a serum so I'm very very happy with this yes I will be getting I'm I'm cashing I will be getting another one I love this and it lasts a long time okay so this is my goat milk soap I this is fresh goat milk soap fragrance free this is key Goat milk soap is very hydrating on the skin, so number one, that's why I love using it. So definitely, it's a cash it, and it's definitely on repeat. And the reason why is that it's free. Uh, Caprina make a fragrance-free version of it. 
You have no idea how hard it is to find fragrance-free soap in Toronto. At one point, it was so impossible that I had to buy this on Amazon.com. Not even Amazon.ca, but .com. Eventually, that source ran out, and then I was panicking, and I finally found it on well.ca. So they sell it, so I was buying it in bulk there. And then one day, I was just walking down the street, and I happened to walk into a local pharmacy not like the shoppers drug mart and found it there because years ago I was buying it at no frills they used to carry this version fragrance free and the fragrance one and I suddenly they just stopped and that's when I went into the spiral panic um, because I couldn't find it anywhere in Toronto and for years I couldn't find it until I found it at this local shop now I'm noticing I just went into shoppers today and they're selling their version of it so I've got to check it out just like two weeks ago and yes I would the option is to go into a health food store and buy goat's milk fragrance free goat's milk soap there problem is is that they're unwrapped they're sitting next to other very highly scented essential oil scented soaps that leach into the fragrance free ones so it makes that soap pointless for me. I couldn't use it. And yes, you've got Dove soap. They have an unscented, but if you ever smell Dove soap, the unscented version, just pick that up and smell it. It has a scent. I can't use that because you know why? I love my fragrance soaps. You have no idea how much I love my fragrance soaps, but I can only use it for my body. So I have one washcloth so that I use my fragrance soap in with my body. And I have a, another washcloth that I use it for my VIP area. Areas. You know what I mean. Um, because my VIP areas get irritated from one wash of a scented soap. Just one wash. Don't need it. Don't want it. If you guys suffer from any sort of candida problems where you can get irritation down there, it could be the reason why. Switch to a fragrance-free soap. So this has been literally a lifesaver for me. And yes, it is on repeat. I need a fragrance-free soap. Please, companies, make proper fragrance-free soaps on top of your beautifully scented soaps for people like us, us sensitive bunnies out there. So definitely cash on repeat. <laughs> This is a highly YouTube made me buy it. This is the Shiseido Facial Cotton. It costs here in Canada around $11 for 165 the square sheets. And they're lovely, they're luxurious. This, I cut it in half. If I had the money, I would buy it on repeat, but I it's too, too expensive. Sorry, it's too expensive. And when I found out, YouTube made me buy this too. I can't afford that when I can go to Costco. These are beautiful. They feel almost as soft. They don't pill. These yeah. ones apparently don't pill, but they kind of do with me. I may be a little bit hard on it, but these ones barely do that. They don't fall apart and they have double sides. This is super soft. And this side is a textured side. And this is by Delon, Delon Plus Premium Cosmetic Cotton Round. And I bought a whole pack this is a hundred in here, and you get a whole pack of it of eight. So that's 800 cotton rounds for $15, okay? $15.99 or something like that, crazy price. $11 for 165 or $15 and you get 800 I'm going for the 800 so no it's not on repeat when I'm feeling extra splurgy I'll buy it I'll cash it but otherwise no this is on repeat so sorry sorry Shiseido love ya I uh, can't afford it. This yeah. is Crosswinds. Crosswind Farms goat milk soap again, but then scented. This is lemongrass. They have French lavender, which I love. Rose geranium with rose petals, which I love. These are beautiful soaps. It is a goat farm located in Ontario locally. 
I just buy it up the street. They're beautiful, they last long, they don't melt, they're hydrating on the skin, they are a spa delight experience, and it's nice to have that scent in your bathroom, and they're just wonderful. They also, this farm, they also have dairy products, so you get your goat milk yogurt, your goat milk what else do they do? Goat milk milk, goat milk cheese, goat milk yogurt, goat milk chevron. Then they have the Happy Body Collection line. Wonderful. It's on Ontario. I'm sorry, supporting locally and definitely on repeat. I want my rose one next time. Lastly, we're going in for another soap here. No, actually, there's two more. Um, this is the oil or what is it called? The Ole Ultra Moisture Vanilla Indulgence Soap. This is, how would I put it? If they fix it, it will be a cash it again. If they're not, it's a trash it. And this is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful soap. Highly emollient. It's an ultra moisture soap and, it, and the name is correct. The scent is I can still smell it. It is absolutely divine, this beautiful vanilla scent. You get four in a pack. They're small bars. They're super, super moisturizing. They're lovely. They're an experience to use. They're a delightful smell. But the only problem is, is that they melt. They do wonderful for the body. I enjoy the experience and I enjoy that my skin is moisturized when I wash, but they don't last long because they fall apart. They melt in contact with water and they just kind of like, you know, like the Wicked Witch of the West melt in, in, the, in, the, in the rain. This is what this does, unfortunately. So if they can fix that with this, listen, I would definitely cash it again, definitely. I would do this on repeat, but they gotta fix it first. Uh, other than that, um, I hate to use the word trash it, but until they fix it, I love you, Ole. Fix this issue, and then we don't we don't have any problems. I will cash you again. Definitely. One more. This is Stash. I can get this locally in my health food store. Stash Black Tea Double Bergamot Earl Grey. Love this. I'm more into loose leaf tea. I've discovered my slow. I didn't even know it's a Canadian made tea company. I will talk about that another time, but this is a beautiful band. When I run out of my, my loose leaf teas and I'm josing for a tea because I have my tea every day. I love Earl Grey tea. You get a double dose of bergamot in it. I'm all for that. They make a lovely line of tea. This is kind of like my backup tea for my loose leaf teas. Definitely a cash. So Glow Beauties, I hope you enjoyed enjoyed my first ever installment of my trash it or cash it product empties video and this is all that we dumpster dived in and decided whether I would trash it or whether I would cash it and it may be a series but I don't go through products that very often so it will be few and far between but when I do I'd love to share it with you guys so you can see all the products whether I would trash it again or whether I'd cash it again and it gives you a little insight on what I like what I don't like uh, what are some really good products I hope this helps you in some way it's kind of fun Enjoyed this little video which is not very little because I really went on a long time with my which one did I go on a long time was my Hada Lobo Hyaluronic Acid. And so if you did enjoy this video, give it a huge thumbs up, like, and definitely share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe. Hit that bell notification button so that you can keep up with all my uploads. And just remember, rock your own kind of beauty and keep on going and keep on glowing. I will.